Hey guys, Forrest Follin and Anthony Steele here from Way of Life Bootcamp, and uh, we are here with a message of congratulations. Congratulations for making it to the halfway point in the 21 day detox. Nice job. Woo! Yes, and uh, we're right there with you. We've been doing everything you've been doing, preparing the meals, um, going through the ups and downs, resisting the cravings, mm -hmm. drinking lots of water, mm -hmm. um, you know, getting our body moving every chance we can at the same time. And um, you know, just eating right, eating good whole foods from the detox, sticking detox approved. And um, you know, we want to thank you for getting on that Facebook group page, uh, putting motivation up, your recipes up. We've been seeing all those great recipes that you've been putting up there. And uh, everyone from Jessica Lewis all the way over there in uh, Sicily um, to uh, Mona Lisa in New York. Thank you, Ooh, Mona Lisa. Uh, Margaret Packer. Um, getting involved. Thank you, Margaret. You have so much wisdom and in inspiration um, in, uh, in person, of course, but on Facebook it translates very well. And um, who else? Uh, Amelia, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Patrick Gordon, um, who are some of the other Glenda, people? Glenda, Glenda, Glenda. Thank you, Glenda. Yeah, yeah she's, Chris she's even brought us some food. Glenda yeah, brought us some food. Oh, yeah, Thank you, Glenda. Yeah, she's always bringing that food. <laughs> yeah. Chris Magison. Chris Magison. Oh, Solutions for Change. Yes, yes. yes. What a leader. Oh, man. Jo uh, Joel. Joel's been tearing it up, too. Oh, Joel. Joel. Well, great job. Yes. You know? How about man. Sean Smith? Man. Oh, Sean. Sean's Sean bringing Smith it. Sean Smith bringing it. He's yeah. getting his whole family involved, too. Wow. His wife's getting involved. And the kids? Uh, hopefully, yeah. Wow, I mean, they're, they're making the food. The kids must be eating it. Let us know, Sean. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's great. Um, let's see who else. There's, there's just so many people that have been getting involved. So we want to thank you yeah. all. We don't have every. We're not going to list every single name that, of every single person, but thank you all. And uh, moving forward, we want you to make sure that you know you're sticking with the things that you're supposed to be doing. Um, stick with that Facebook posting. That's a crucial part of the accountability process. And um, what else? Oh, don't get complacent. Mm -hmm. Don't get complacent. There's a lot of holiday parties right now. Mm -hmm. Anthony and I went to a really great holiday party last Friday, right? Oh, yeah. It was going down. Uh, it was going down. The food was amazing. Mm -hmm. um, it was at the uh, Lisa Nichols holiday party. It was just so cool to be there around the, all these amazing people. Um, and the food was amazing. Her son is a chef, and he's been around the world uh, learning how to cook. and Beasting it. Yeah, he came out with the great food, but... Hit the palate and just was boom. Oh man, yeah, Jaylani, thank you very much. Uh, thank you. And uh, but you know what he did for for uh, Arlene and I? Did he do this for you too? He took the the um, the beef patty out of the the slider, mm. and we just ate it as is, and we had the salad on the side. Well, I kind of did mine ghetto. I, I took the beef slider down. I started wiping it with a napkin, and people were looking <laughs> at me pretty crazy. Like, you just had the bun sitting there yeah, on the side. Yeah, the bun sitting on the side. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's all right. So, so however you have to do it, I mean, you have to make changes on the go, and you have to be willing to be adaptable and versatile, and and not have all the answers, but understand that you have the tools. All right, and the resources, and that we're right here with you. So, um, you know, don't get complacent. Make your meals. I know that uh, Chris Megason was sharing that, you know, him and his wife Tammy went right into it. They started making their meals um, in week two, and they felt really good about that. We saw some posts on Facebook about that, foods in the Tupperware and everything. So, get your meals up there. Yes. Hello, Kate, how you doing? Yeah. And um, what else? What are we missing? Oh, yeah. I, I, awesome I you think you, you really hit everything and just to add a little bit to what we're saying is uh, way of life boot campers here we go this is an opportunity to turn this really into a habit mm -hmm. to ignite a habit you know we started off with maybe not so good of habits with our eating um, and now we're starting to eat a lot of food but a lot of food that's great for us yeah. organic whole foods that are highly nutritious that if it's if you sustain this and I really suggest that you do. It can create a huge change. I did a 21-day fast about six years ago that is virtually basically the same thing. And uh, it, I stuck to it, obviously, because it was 21 days. And there's something about the power of 21 that we spoke about in one of our beginning videos here mm -hmm. in the detox. And right now being in that, that, that point where you're at uh, here in the halfway point, like Coach Forrest said, it could easily become a complacent type of thing. Um, it can easily be something where you could even fall back. And so what we're hoping here with this video is that it creates that transformation because we've been in a motivation 
type of part right here. But motivation can flicker out. Mm -hmm. So here we go. This is time to sustain, stick to it, stay in it, and mm -hmm. watch the habits that you reap 21 days, 42 days, you know, 82 days, and going into 365 days That's and right. seeing yourself five, six years down the road, you know, saying, being able to say no at that next Christmas party when it comes up or Thanksgiving or that next gathering and being able to eat the correct food no matter what's going on rain sleet and snow in your life so that's we're just right. so excited for you that's right yeah it's definitely yeah to add to that it's just taking that motivation and creating permanent behavior changes mm -hmm. and habits around that because motivation can be fleeting all right you, you've all heard of or maybe even been to like a motivational seminar or listen to a motivational tape and you're like yeah this is awesome mm -hmm. in the in the moment and uh, you know, two days later, it's not there anymore. Why not? Because you know, you didn't turn it into a behavioral change. Mm. And so that's what we're trying to do: is really take that power of 21. 21 days affects a habit, mm. and uh, turn it into a lifestyle. And you may not stick with everything, but maybe it's just the brown rice, or wow. maybe it's just the water, or maybe you're just eating more fruits and vegetables. <laughs> Something's gonna stick. And the good news is, you can come back to this. This is something we do a couple times a year. You know, you don't have to to say goodbye. You know, this could be an ongoing process. And, um, you know, we come back to it often. It helps us realign uh, with integrity, you know, why we do what we do, which is, um, you know, share the passion of fitness, but we have to be in integrity of the, with that. So, you know, we can't uh, go off, uh, you know. Popping apple pies and cake all the time. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Once in a while you can yeah, indulge, yeah, yeah. but, you know, um, we want to, you know, be eating the best quality foods for our body and bring our energy up. So. Hopefully you've been having greater energy, uh, you know, sticking away from the coffee and drinking the green tea and um, doing all the things that, you know, can create great energy in your body. And um, that, that's about it. Yeah. Yeah. Way of life. Way of life. Thank you very much. We'll see you guys soon. Check in with us on Facebook. See ya. Boom.